Hey, it's Sherry with Legacy Max Support, and I'm here today to introduce you to our Facebook group. If you'd like to visit Facebook and go directly to this group yourself, you can visit www.facebook.com slash groups slash Legacy Max Support all together. And we will have a link in the back office, um, probably in the FAQ section or in our support area uh, in some way. So when you get to this group, um, you'll see uh, where you see my cursor right now, it says notifications. There'll be a big button here that says join group. So just click join group. It'll be right here under reduce emissions big green button, just click join group and the, one of the admins or myself will add you to the group. And you'll receive an email notification at your Facebook um, email address that we've added you to the group. Then you can visit the group and uh, just simply come here to the gear and let me actually remove this from my favorites and then I'll add it back. You'll want to come here and click add to favorites. And that group will show up um, under your Facebook feed over here as one of your favorite groups. It'll be separated from all the other groups. And you want to be sure that this notifications is turned on and set to all posts rather than off. That way you'll see new posts in the group um, and you can learn from them. Let me show you a couple other things. Be sure and read um, about our group. This is a community of active Legacy Max members interested in helping each other. Post your questions about Legacy Max and please do not use this as a platform to promote other opportunities or you will be removed. This is a place where we want to help one another out. You can ask questions or answer other people's questions if you have some helpful information. Um, but any links that lead to other websites or other opportunities will, uh, number one, your post will be removed immediately and um, violators will be towed, <laughs> uh, will actually kick you out of the group. So you don't want to lose access to this very valuable tool that you have to grow your Legacy Max business. So let me show you what you can do. So when you're logged into Facebook and you're in this group, you can um, post a question. So you might say something like, has anybody successfully used flyers on bulletin boards to promote Legacy Max? And you could post that question and someone might respond or answer and that would be great. Um, that would be a, you know, a great question. And so if somebody posted this and you have notifications turned on, you'll see that in your, um, your email. If you use Gmail, it'll be on your social tab. I'm not sure how other email works, but in Gmail, it'll be on the social tab. And so if you, if you have an answer, um, I have blah, 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 um, some comments about that here and then you could you could answer that okay what we don't want you to do is say things like hey I just earned you know 50k this month with www dot you know scam biz dot com blah 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 or um, you know any other opportunity, you want to just avoid pasting any sort of links on here. Or coming in here and posting and asking people to friend you because we know that, you know, if you can connect with active people and get them to friend you, you can start communicating with them. Please do not um, use this, this helpful platform in a manner that is unethical. Um, keep the conversation about Legacy Max and let's keep it clean so that this can be a very valuable tool for you and your team and, and, and everyone in Legacy Max. 
Now, if you do post something, um, if if I am an admin to this group, or for those of you watching who are admins to this group, you can simply delete the post. Um, because I'm an admin, I can't block myself, but there's also an uh, on the drop-down list, there's an option to delete post and remove user. So if you're an admin to this group and you see somebody um, post something that violates our rules, our very simple rules, you can just come in and um, delete that post yourself as an admin to the group. All right, that's it. Um, again, we just want to keep this a helpful sharing community. If there are um, other people in your Legacy Max team that you'd like to add to the group, um, I believe that once you're a member, you can simply come to the group and add people. Um, you'd have to be friends with them on Facebook, but um, like Tim Stevens, our great CEO, I could add him right here. I'm friends with him and so he shows up when I start typing his name but he's already a member um, but you can add um, your team members this way and for a while um, as admins we will probably just go ahead and um, you know add everyone who requests to join but we'll be um, monitoring that content so hope that helps um, welcome to our legacy max support group um, Let's help each other out. Let's help each other build Legacy Max um, big, and let's go help a lot of people change the world, change our planet, and save a lot of money on gas, and um, protect our cars, and all that good stuff. This is Sherry Kirkland. Bye for now.